might not realize it, but what we do on land has an enormous effect on the ocean. For instance, as the world's population grows, we're demanding much more from our farmland. We're applying more and more fertilizer, which contains nutrients like nitrogen and phosphorus to increase food production. However, too much fertilizer on farms and on lawns and gardens is a problem. Why? Because when we use too much of it, or apply it in the wrong place or at the wrong time, plants can't absorb it all. These excess nutrients get washed into streams and rivers, and eventually into the ocean. This process is referred to as nutrient runoff. Fertilizer in the water makes algae grow. A bountiful crop on land might be a good thing, but a bountiful crop of algae in the water can be a disaster. Here's why. Excess algae block the sunlight that aquatic life needs to survive. Some algae also release toxins that impact human health. Worst of all, when algae die and decompose, they consume all the oxygen in the surrounding water. This results in widespread fish kills and habitat destruction, creating so-called dead zones. Enormous dead zones in the Gulf of Mexico and the Chesapeake Bay have already had an impact on the health and economies of people living there, costing the United States an estimated $2.2 billion annually. And the problem keeps growing. Dead zones have increased around the world from 10 in 1960 to 405 in 2008. Fortunately, there are things we can do to help. If you have a yard or garden, use fertilizers in moderation and consider planting more native species, which require less fertilizer. Consider buying organic food. If you're a farmer, look for alternatives to phosphorus and nitrogen-based fertilizers, and use fertilizers more efficiently. Consider using cover crops as nutrient filters and buffers to reduce runoff. If you're a decision maker, you can put in place measures that improve the management of nutrients. Less waste of fertilizer not only benefits the ocean, it saves money. So do your part to reduce nutrient runoff and protect our oceans.